Hello everyone, and welcome back to my channel. In this video I'm gonna show you how to install Box64 for any Android phone, which you can install and play Windows files and games on your hand. As you can see, my phone is powered by Snapdragon 750G with Adreno 619 graphics. Check out the links and requirements provided in description. First of all thanks to developers and contributors of this successful project. So let's start the video. Just scroll down you will find two files one is Termex and Termex X11 version you need to install both these apps on your device. After installation, just copy the code to clipboard. Now open Termix and allow all permissions. Paste the code into terminal and enter. As you can see the various versions. Choose the option based on your device. If you are a non-root user the, choose one and enter. It loads up some files. Enable storage permissions. Here by default, use command Y for all the actions. Here the installation starts. After successful install, here use the command box 64 droid to start the box 64 android. Here before going into it, you need to again update box 64 and box 86 to make sure without any errors. After a successful installation, press enter, it closes the app. Now open Termix app. Enter command box 64 droid, start. So it loads various options. Here enter into box 64. Choose resolution or you can even use custom or default desktop resolution. Now go to home, open and load Termix X11 app and wait for it. As you can see it loads Windows system based on ARM based on x86 and 64 platforms, where you can run Windows, exe files easily. Now got to start, select DXVK, choose version 2, 2 to install, that's it. Also make sure to install Gecko Installer, so that you can efficiently use Windows on ARM. Here as you can see I'm installing Windows based EXE files on phone which are even based on 64-bit, 
You can directly load files from Android slash to download path which here is indicated with D drive. Remember your phone should powerful enough to run and execute Windows apps games like considering at least Snapdragon 845 or higher, also at least Adreno 600 or above GPU, to work. I hope you like the video, make sure you subscribed, click on bell icon for more interesting stuff. Thanks for watching, see you in the next one.